What's going on everybody and welcome to this brief overview of the new Core King VST, the latest from Produce R&B and I'm excited to take you through some of the features and give you an idea of the power behind this plugin. Now with Core King VST you have a massive library of nearly a thousand MIDI chords and progressions. You have over 600 progressions and almost 200 something individual chords that you can also play to generate your own progressions with. Now, the Chord King makes it very easy to browse through such a massive library of ideas by categorizing the progressions by key, okay, with these easy buttons right here on the interface. Now, it also allows you to quickly audition progressions because each key on your MIDI keyboard will hold a unique progression, giving you a lightning fast way to go through and find exactly what you're looking for, find the inspiration that drives you. Okay, now this eliminates the need to go through several different packs and tediously import MIDI file after MIDI file until you find what you're looking for. Now, this is called the Core King because Produce R&B has combined all of its MIDI chord progression releases into this one convenient plugin. But there's new content in here too. The idea is that there is no better way to access and utilize everything Produce R&B has to offer in terms of chords and progressions. Now, it has over 50 sounds that you can experiment with you got keyboards, pads, pianos, synth, different categories within that. All right. And of course, if you want to use your own VSTs, your own sounds, you can quickly and easily drag and drop any progression straight from the VST into your DAW, to your DAW. Go in, edit the file, edit the MIDI, uh, transpose it, do whatever you need. You can also transpose it right here within the plugin so that you don't have to even leave the plugin before you get your idea straight. Um, so, yeah, it's simply drag and drop. It's going to drag and drop whatever is here uh, playing in the window pane. Um, so, right now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and go through the plugin show you guys some of the progressions some of the sounds and uh, I'm gonna walk you through what I'm doing as I do it and kind of briefly uh, explain this plugin it's very super simple and it's very powerful as well all right let's get into it
So, so far I've been just going up the keys and playing the progressions using the uh, the the key tabs right here on the front but right now I'm gonna hit the manual select button and I'm gonna go ahead and just select the various chord progressions within this key Let's try another key. So right now I'm going to go ahead and activate the chord mode by clicking here and it's going to now play individual chords as I go up the keys. So clicking here will allow me to play the instrument straight out without playing any chords or progressions. Just free play. Now we're going to make sure this is on when we want to play the chords and progressions again. You'll need to select a key in order to activate the progressions. So right here, you can reverse the sample. You can play the sounds in reverse. Above that, you have the volume control. Uh, down here, you also have the control over your velocity, your attack and release. And down here, you have the ability to transpose any sound within the plugin. Thank you. 
so down here at the bottom of the plugin to the left you have your settings tab and this is where you can change the size of the plugin you have all your uh, general settings you can also change the sample folder location uh, and make sure your samples are in the right place All right, so now let's just go through, let's audition some of these different sounds. Thank uh you. -huh. 